Hey y'all, it's uh, May 30th, be a woodchucker update. Uh, I went ahead and put some guarding on it. This, uh, this one here, I'm not sure I even needed that one, but I was uh, monkeying around with it a little a while after I put the back guard on it, and I just felt a little squeamish, so I said, yeah, one more guard ink hurt none, so, you know what, that gets me roughly that, uh, that size of wood, which is, uh, I think a 2 by 6 will get in there, so, so if I can get a 6 inch round in there, that's a lot. Uh, I went ahead and put the stop on. And if you look, you can see there's a bend there. It, uh, when it feeds, it feeds real nice, but then it tends to start binding. And it, you can see it pushing this down and out. So I'm going to take this and put a bit of an angle on it that way. And I think that'll help. I think initially I'm just going to cut, cut it and just run it and see how far it pushes it down and maybe it'll find its own happy spot. So I'll pound that back straight before I do it. But uh, yeah you can see it uh, that's a fairly sturdy piece of metal and it just just went to town on that. No, no, no effort at all. So here's the back. And, uh, yeah, so I could basically get right in there and not have to worry about nothing. But, uh, not like I'm going to, but uh, it feels a whole lot safer these days. Uh, I still want to do something with uh, the rub wheel and the tire. Because it's, it's kind of, uh, you know, when, when I'm walking around here, it's a little bit intimidating as well. But it also, until I get the, the cutter to where it doesn't stall, there's times when I have to I get have to get on the tire and give it a, a couple of shoves. So right now it uh, it's just going to have to be open for the moment. Uh, yeah, that's about it, I think. Oh. The chute. I put uh, these pieces in here to take up some of the space because the wood just flopping around too much. And I found that I'll probably have to. I'll, I have to make this smaller because it's still. You know, if the wood isn't directed relatively straight, it just affects too many things. So I may take a piece of this and go like that with it. And I think that would probably get me what I'm looking for. I'm not sure. But, uh, yeah. I think I'll put this on a tripod and I'll, I'll uh, do a short video of it the way it is. And then I'll do one after I get it modified. So that'll be it for this one.